TikTok's getting the axe in the USA, or at least this is the closest we've come to having TikTok banned in the United States. I use TikTok a lot. Actually, I upload a daily sword fighting training video and combat footage on there every day. So I have a pretty cool save list of videos. It's like Boo Hurt, SCA, some foam fighting, HEMA stuff. And I'm gonna share them with you now. This way, if TikTok does get the ax officially, I wanna have a place where I can come back and watch these videos. And I hope you enjoy them too. This is gonna be an ongoing little series we're gonna do. So let's get started. All right, this is the this is the first one here. This is actually my favorite video. <laughs> so I have watched this so many times, and look, it's like he whacked him in the back of the head twice. Ian is a huge dude. He's actually the same one from this picture right here at Carolina Carnage who got that axe stuck in his eye slot with that same helmet. This dude is a giant and he took two hits to the back of the head from that guy and just turns around. All right, the next one we got here, oh, this is funny, but we gotta turn down because of copyrights issues, you know, we're gonna turn down the music, but check these, check these guys out here. I, I actually found this video like two days ago. <laughs> headbutt, 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 and they're still doing it. That is like, that's actually one of my favorite videos of the newer ones I've found. Here we go. Punch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And they're just holding each other and doing it. They're both doing it at the same time. A dozen headbutts. So I logged on a TikTok today when I decided to try and make this video. The first for you video was this one right here. Now, if you notice, this guy with the buckler blocks with the arm, blocks with the arm. Look, this goes under the armpit. Now, uh, I don't know if that's a really good idea. Here's why. So, he is in a very advantageous position. We're going to pause it right there. He has the sword pointed at the other guy's torso. The attacker's arm is now bound with the uh, the, the buckler in, in the sword there, you know. And he has the point right here. Back in the day, that is like a fatal wound. The guy, though, has a sharp blade under here. Now, these would have been battles like out in the streets, you know, a fight, a dispute, and you may or may not even have clothing on there. This guy's actually just in like his, his workout tank top or something. But, um, you know, obviously a lot of people just wear clothing and you're at risk of also dying too because, did you know, in, in Boo Hurt, I'll just let this play. Armored Combat just started making these rules now, especially Armored MMA. No strikes up under the armpit. You know why? In my last pro fight I had last weekend, they said there's major arteries that run through there. I believe this is probably not the smartest thing to do. You may get your bicep cut there, but that right there goes under some major arteries. Uh, you know, I just saved this video. I'm going to actually unsave it just because I wanted to share it. I think that's kind of dumb. Uh, comment below. What do you think? Is that is this a dumb idea right here? It's cool, but in a way, you're probably gonna get yourself killed too, or at least a, a very nasty infection. Back then, there's no antibiotics. Also, while we're at it, leave a comment if you like this idea, you like these little videos I'm sharing. This guy right here, False Edge Hema. Check this out. Great saber fencing. This guy has great videos. Actually, this has like over 650,000 likes, but just look at that. This guy is actually really good. I follow him. Uh, I like to use sabers. That's a really cool video right there. Last video, this is about, this is going to be something where, yeah, got to keep it muted. But look, birthday party celebration. This is some of the femme fighters, and they're actually battling while there's a pinata. And this is actually a cool video here because even at, and at the end, they both dive down there. And grab what they can and fall out of the out of the um, pinata. So I think that's a cool video there. Cool stuff. I hope you like this little video here. Next next one will be five more. Maybe I'll try and make it a little bit shorter. I want people just watch these and get on with their day. You're not spending five minutes in here watching these with me. So if you like them, please comment, share it, let me know. Oh man, and that is like my favorite video. He turns around and that guy number one hitting him in the back just gets the heck out of there. Bam, bam. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed the video. If TikTok gets the X, you can always come back here and find these great medieval videos from TikTok on this channel. Stay tuned for the next one. Don't forget to leave a like. Subscribe so you don't miss the next one. We'll catch you in the next video.